Hey guys, Dustin Pankery, Snowtech Magazine, and <clears throat> I'm on the 2021 uh, Skidoo 850 Turbo Freeride. Um, probably, this was probably the most anticipated machine for the 2021 uh, release. A lot of people have been excited about it, asking questions, having, wanting to know what it's like. And I think probably the biggest question we're getting asked right now is, which version of the 850 Turbo is right for them? Whether it's the X package, whether it's the free ride package, which I'm on here, or whether it's the expert package. So I'm going to go through and kind of try to just describe the differences between the three, and hopefully that'll help you decide which sled might be best for you. So let's start with the X package. Um, the X package, the, the main differences between it and the other two packages are it uses a little bit softer calibration on the shocks. Um, it does not have the adjustable limiter strap. It has the standard medium uh, bar riser. Um, and it's, it's, the, it's similar to what we saw that early release yellow, um, the 2020 and a half that they released early back in February. Um, it's got the Kashima coated front shocks, uh, mono tubes, and then mono tubes all the way around. But the valving inside there is a little softer than what came in the Expert or the Freeride. Where that sled really shines for us is we feel like that's the easiest sled to initiate into a turn. Um, roll into its side because of that softer valving. Um, it's nice and plush through the soft stuff and it, and it initiates those drop-ins really easy. Um, bigger guys or faster guys will find that they can push the suspension to its limit and they may want something a little stiffer. So then let's go to this sled here, uh, the free ride. So the major differences here is now we add the uh, piggyback adjustable KYBs. Um, we've got the rail brace, we've got the medium height bar riser. We do not have the adjustable limiter strap. Um, where this sled really shines is if you want some adjustability for conditions, changing conditions, if you're going to be in some really big bumps, some rough terrain, you want to stiffen the shocks up. Uh, and then maybe the next weekend you get up there, you're in the deep, deep power, you want to soften them up and make it feel more like the X. Uh, you've got the uh, adjustability to do that. And it is also maybe beefed up just a little bit compared to the other two models. For guys that are going to be doing the hard hits, you know, big jumps, uh, hill climbing, whatever, with those rail braces and whatnot. <clears throat> so that's that's kind of the differences between the X and the free ride. And then we go to the expert package. The expert package uses the Kashima coated monotube shocks in the front, but they're a little bit stiffer valving in the X. More, they're, they're a little more similar to the free ride, uh, not exactly the same. And then on the back, we've got the a similar shock to the free ride with the adjustability on the rear shock. Um, the Expert also has the adjustable limiter strap, um, but the valving overall and the suspension calibration is made for aggressive riding. Um, and it's also probably the lightest available package uh, for the guy who wants to be aggressive. So <clears throat> it's probably similar in weight to the X, but it is uh, more aggressive in the calibration for the suspension. So. Uh, for that guy who really wants to be as light as they possibly can, but push hard and have that stiffer valving, the expert package is going to be really good for them. And then also if they want that adjustable limiter strap. For us personally, I think our favorite setup that we've ridden so far, we've had been able to spend time on all three, is the X package. Or I'm sorry, the expert. Uh, mainly because the valving works good for a wide range of riders, even, even for a uh, lighter rider. If, if you're aggressive, it's, it's going to work well. But the adjustable limiter strap... Uh, we're finding conditions where we really need that. If you get it like today, we've got, you know, 8, 10, 12 inches in some spots, hero snow in other spots, and we're really hooking up, and we're finding we get more transfer than we really need or want. And being able to adjust that limiter strap tighter is a pretty, is a pretty beneficial advantage, um, an option. So if a guy wants the adjustable shops, shocks, of course, you can get the free ride and then add the adjustable limiter strap to that. So that's a nice accessory that they sell. Um... And one more thing I forgot to add on the Expert package, it runs the shorter four and a half, four, I think it's a four inch riser, a little bit shorter riser. So again, for more aggressive riding, getting in that attack position, getting lower, uh, the Expert package has that shorter riser. So hopefully that kind of describes the strengths of each package and maybe helps you decide which one might work best for you. Um, subscribe to our YouTube channel because we're going to do more of these informative videos. Find us on Instagram and Facebook, like our pages. That'll hopefully help you find all the videos and the information that we're on.